Protect the Castle is a fantastic game to work on your students' accuracy, awareness, and reaction. And it's an awesome opportunity to practice different sports skills such as soccer passing, hockey striking, or football throwing as well. So let's check it out. The aim of this activity is to defend your cones from the incoming balls. And for this, you are going to need seven or more soft balls, balls that can be thrown, they can be rubber or bouncy. You also need 10 cones or markers, and you need seven or more different targets. So you can use tall cones or pins and something that can be knocked over. So to set up this game, you need to mark out a large circle using those cones. And around the outside of that circle, you're gonna put all those different balls. In the middle of the circle, you're gonna put out all those different targets, the tall cones and the pins in the middle. Now everyone is gonna stand around the outside of the circle with the balls. And your teacher's gonna choose two or three of you to stand in the middle area around those targets. Now those targets are actually the castle that you're trying to knock down. The balls are the rocks that are trying to be thrown to knock down the castle. And those players in the middle are actually defenders or knights who are trying to defend the incoming rocks from destroying the castle. So to play this game, the teacher calls fire. And when the teacher calls fire, Everyone on the outside tries to throw their ball to knock down the targets to try and destroy that castle. Now, the blockers or the knights in the middle try and stop those balls from hitting the castle. So you can use your body to defend and hit those balls away that are trying to come and hit those targets down. Now, if someone from the outside throws the ball and a knight catches it, then that knight gets to pick up a knockdown target and put it back up. And the game ends when all the targets have been knocked down. A few different variations your teacher might play with you. Your teacher might say that you have to chest pass the ball. So you have to throw the ball in with two hands to try and knock down the targets. Now remember, you can only throw from the outside of the circle. Maybe you can use soccer balls and you have to kick the balls in to try and destroy the castle using your feet only. Or maybe if you have hockey equipment available, you can use your stick and small balls and tennis balls to try and knock down those targets. So this is an awesome game. I hope everyone has fun out there and enjoy.